This is Predator Raw. We're back, and we're here in Dallas, Texas, and don't adjust your TV screens. You've seen this man before. 37-year-old Dusty Hinkenbottom and I have met before. It was a little over 10 years ago, and Dusty was one of the most disturbing predators I had ever met. Dusty had a combination of creepiness and confidence we have never seen to this day. Some peanut butter and jelly, but the mixed kind, like the peanut butter and jelly mix. But also one of the nastiest. You tell him right here also you want to give him a strawberry shortcake, screaming seagull, a hot car, a white dragon, a damn Cosby sweater. Some of the things Dusty said to me were downright disturbing. Turns out, Dusty was a huge fan of yours truly. You're my freaking hero, man. I love Chris Hansen. I love when you bust them pedophiles on TV. But Dusty's celebration was short-lived. We're to come talk about football and baseball and have fun with them, man. <laughs> Once our hidden cameras came out, he became distraught, ran away, and ran right into the arms of our head of security, Scott, where Scott promptly leveled him to the ground. And now, he's back. But right before Dusty showed up, we had our own technical difficulties. The decoy, who originally was scheduled to be there, ended up being sick, so we had to pull an audible at the last moment. You use the ointment, right? Nah, I just live that shit like a real man. What the fuck? I couldn't do it. Bro, I'll tell you, five minutes mm -hmm. of fucking pissing fucking razor blades. Mm -hmm. Guys, uh, yeah, what? guys, we, we have a problem, okay? The decoy is sick. And she's not gonna make it. Now we need a new decoy, and obviously you can't be the decoy because Dusty knows who you are. Right. What? You've been drafted. Oh hell no. Come on, man. Hey. Hi. Come on, lady. What took you so long? Oh, you, traffic was crazy. You know, oh, man, there's potholes everywhere, and. I sure will. Yeah, make oh. yourself comfortable, pumpkin. You look a lot different than your pictures. Oh, you know, just work them angles. Why don't you suck on some of these sweet tarts? Oh, thank you for the sweet tarts. You know, this is one of my favorites. You know, maybe later we can turn these sweet tarts into me sucking on them sweet farts. <laughs> um, okay. What, what did you bring me? Well, <laughs> we're gonna have a fun night, that's all I know. Let me show you. We got some Altoids, condoms, some raisins. Raisins? You might like this actually. Some taco seasoning. Why would I like that? I, I don't know. You, you, you look like a spicy girl. Fucking you know, raisins? <laughs> maybe I can sprinkle this on you and we can really have a fiesta. I brought you a very special rare Charizard. Something I want to do later with that. You know, I brought this video camera. Maybe later we can do our own establishing shots. <laughs> well, what do you um want to do with with me? <laughs> well, a uh, little known fact about me is I have the fastest tongue this side of the Mississippi. And if you'd like, I'd love to show you my oral skills. <sighs> Tell me, have you ever, ever had your ass eaten? I was thinking maybe later we could do a little grapevine action. Grapevine? Well, well, what's that? Well, that's where you and me both go take a poop and don't wipe, and then after a couple hours, we get some dingleberries and we go harvesting. What the f***? Well, first, I'd like to hold you. That that sounds actually normal. And then and then kiss you. Okay, okay where? And then taste your, your body all up and down. Chris? Why don't you come sit on my lap? Ay, Dios mio. Louis Caliente. Aw, oh, hell no. Chris, you better come get this motherfucker. Chris. <sighs> whoa, 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 Dusty. If it isn't, Dusty, why are you here again? Chris. What are you doing here? Dusty, you've been through this before. What are you doing? What are you thinking about? 
You know we've met before. Calm down. How is this possible? It's been 10 years. Oh, Lord. How could you do this after 10 years? I thought you may have learned your lesson, but no, here you are. Dusty, what are you doing bringing taco seasoning? It's a little racist. Condoms, raisins. What is going on in your head? I, I didn't mean it. I just, I wanted to be friends. I mean, but buddies, the friends. Hell no, he was talking all that crazy shit. You shut up. You're not even Florcita. Chris, how could you do this to me? I thought we were friends. Yeah. I told you last time you were my fucking hero. Well, you know what they say about meeting your heroes. You'll be disappointed. But nobody's more disappointed than me, Dusty. I didn't, I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. I swear this time, I didn't mean it. I swear. These are some of the dirtiest things I've ever heard. Let's, let's, let's go through a couple of them here. You said you wanted to do a dirty penguin, a Mississippi bird bath. A Blunken plunger? You ain't never had a Blunken plunger? What is that? Oh, well, that's where you're giving me oral sex, but you ain't good enough So I, while I'm taking the shit, so I stick your head in the toilet. I gotta say, that's a little disturbing. A Canadian porch swing. You wanted to go Charizarding with her? That's why I brought the Charizard. That's not even Charizard, it's Charmander. What is going on in your head? You said you wanted to do a Ben Franklin. Well, you're all about those Benjamins, aren't you? What do you think our forefathers would have to say if you used the great Benjamin Franklin's name in such vain? Where were you at on January 6th? A screaming seagull? Now you're just pulling up the old hits, huh? A hot Carl? A Mike and Ike? And a fucking Cosby sweater? Are you serious right now, Dusty? I thought through all these years, you would have learned, while I've gained 30 pounds and become fat handsome, that you would learn some self-respect and stop doing these chats with these young people. What do you have to say for yourself? I'm sorry, I just, I wanted to become a Pokemon master with him. I'm sorry, I, I, I didn't mean it. I, I'm lonely, I don't have nobody. Why can't you find somebody your age? Not everybody likes getting on. Look, I promise I wasn't gonna do anything bad. I just wanted to talk about football. We could have watched a football game. We could have watched Steelers and Ravens. We could have done all kinds of things. I just wanted a friend to have fun with. And instead, now you ruined my sexual adventures again, Chris. You son of a bitch. You're not my hero no more. You're a bitch. You're a c**k. You're a bitch ass motherfucker. And I hate you. I hate you, Chris. I hate you. So, Dusty, you been here before? I think you know what's about to happen. You!
Can I still give a Cosby sweater? No! I hate you, Chris Hansen. You bitch. Instead of Pokemon, looks like the only thing Dusty will be catching today is these hands. I'm Chris Hansen. Good night. Oh, <laughs> oh,